Well, this year we would have been celebrating the 15th anniversary of the Capitol Catwalk to benefit Dress for Success Hartford with a sold out crowd as it is every year at the Hartford stage. In a year like no other, it's more important than ever to still find a way to lift women up and help them succeed even in the face of unprecedented change. Absolutely. The woman you are about to meet is our client of the year. She proves faith, resilience and a helping hand can overcome just about anything. I thought I had a successful career. I was with a company for um, 15 years and then um, all of a sudden um, my position was eliminated <laughs> and um, I was saddened by it and um, trying to figure out how am I going to um, provide for my girls um, who are still both in college, um, keep the mortgage, keep a roof over her head and food. <laughs> Minerva Beavers was down, but not out. A woman at the unemployment office told her to call Dress for Success Hartford. Thankfully, she mustered the courage to ask for help. DFS welcomed her to the facility in downtown Hartford for an employment readiness program. A lot of people think, oh, Dress for Success, they give suits and they give clothing. It's so much more than that, right? Absolutely. It's way more than that. Um, is the friendships that you form along the way, um, the mentoring that you get, um, the advice, the coaching. Um, Dress for Success in itself, what it offers is not only the Employment to Readiness program, um, they equip you as a woman um, who will fall hill to some something along life's way, whatever the situation is, they equip you for getting back out into the workforce. Minerva graduated and is now an example for other women. If it weren't for the pandemic, she'd be up on stage giving her speech to help the next generation of clients at the Capitol Catwalk. The 15th anniversary Capitol Catwalk event at the Hartford stage can't happen in person this year. But thanks to our generous sponsors, Dress for Success is still celebrating Minerva and the other women who have reclaimed their lives. We want to thank Talbot who gave you a brand new outfit. Yes, <laughs> thank you Talbot and thank you ladies who helped me um, during the process of getting my outfit. Really appreciate yeah. that. We have fashionistas here who help dress you and yes. do all those things. And for my hair, it's Blaze. Blaze Salon <laughs> helped you with a whole new hair, yes. yes. <laughs> so, but, so, you know, when you look good on the outside, it helps you feel more confident. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, after um, losing my job for 15 years, I was broken. Um, very broken and then just coming here. Not only broken, I felt um, worthlessness. It starts with a suit, but Dress for Success programming leads women to self-sufficiency. Joining Dress for Success um, changed that for me. Um, it not only equipped me in going back out into the work field, it also gave me uh, um, self-worth and let me realize that there is something more inside of me. So in the program, um, we learn many things, you know, just how to write a resume, um, how to write a proper cover letter when, you know, in your job search, we learn how to um, talk, we talk about the, the self, w woman, how would you care for yourself? And the team of women coaches is there to cheer on Minerva. It prepared me in such a way that when I was doing my job search, I give it like 110%. I was doing 40 resumes a week, sometimes more than that, because I really wanted to land this job. and. You know, with everything that um, Dress for Success has taught me and given me, I really put that to work. With the doors at Dress for Success Hartford closed due to the pandemic, Executive Director Sarah Avatapali says mentors have moved online to continue the mission. In March, our organization turned on a dime to meet the needs and challenges of our women. Everything went virtual. All of the programming that we do for employment readiness, employment retention, we wanted to make sure we could be there to assist our women in this time of need. From street corner suitings to a new virtual Capital Catwalk event to help more women like Minerva, the mission continues. It's a good thing strength is contagious here and hard work 
coupled with helping hands leads to happy endings. I am a proud office manager for a home care agency in Bloomfield. Nice. And you got your smile back. You <laughs> yes. feel good about what you do. Yes. Um, I gain my self-worth, confidence. I'm back and just happy to help people overall and to tell my story to other ladies, letting them know that it doesn't matter what befalls you, you can rise above it. I just wanna say thank you um, to Dress for Success and the Professional Women's Group, Hartford Division, for helping me to achieve um, the success I have today. She's just a great, great woman who's overcome so much. You can help Dress for Success Hartford continue its mission of helping other women rise high in our community by attending the free virtual Capital Catwalk event. It's going to be live on the WFSB Facebook page. It's Wednesday night. This Wednesday night at 7.30 p.m. to 8. Just head to the WFSB Facebook page. Like us if you haven't already. Make sure to tune in to our Facebook live event. You will be able to donate or just watch some really powerful stories. Yeah, we're also going to honor Denise DeCenzo with a special tribute at the end of the virtual event. Of course, Denise attended all of the Capitol catwalks for the last 15 years, wowing the crowd in her gowns for the finale, so you can see that as well. That's going to be a beautiful thing. All right.